The European Commission's Joint Research Center is working on introducing the principles of the three R's replacement, reduction and refinement of animal use for scientific purposes in primary and secondary education. Teachers across Europe and beyond, coordinated by the European Schoolnet, have tested the newly developed 3Rs learning scenarios and additional resources. In this video, teachers will share their impressions and recommendations from the experience. This was the first time I introduced my 10-year-old students to the 3Rs. The lesson plan I implemented was very well structured and offered many open-ended questions and resources to guide discussions. I have two students with special educational needs who have difficulties in expressing themselves verbally. That means they were not so active in discussions, but when they have a chance to fill the thing he had's worksheets for the human-based science methods, they were much more engaged. I think that 3 hours materials can help to keep that balance due to the variety of topics and activities offered. The teachers can select which type of task to perform, which tools to use, and how deep they can dive into the topics with their students. I implemented the three arts learning scenario during two physics and one geography lessons within the same week. My class has 19 students, among whom are four students with special educational needs. All my students attended the implementation of the new material, enjoyed the activities and gladly participated in the tasks. Even though they were connected to our educational program, it was clearly a new and different subject that motivated them to be engaged. In the class where I taught the resource, there are a few children who have difficulties with activities such as reading and spelling and with organizing themselves. To integrate students with special educational needs fully into the activity, I made students work in groups. This way, sense students could count on their peers when performing the tasks. I think it is very important for primary school students to learn about the three R's. They can become familiar with the notions of replacement, reduction and refinement and with the basic facts of animal research. Teaching the three R's topics can empower students to develop their skills, knowledge and critical thinking. It can also help to engage them in real-world issues and authentic learning. One of the key activities foreseen by this learning scenario is the debate. Since it is a new experience for my students, I decided to dedicate more time to teach the topic and to allow students to research and prepare arguments. In all these tasks, students engage their families, who help them with the home assignments. Soon, not only my students, but also their family members became so interested in the topic. In the end, all planned activities and the debate were well implemented. I believe that this learning scenario helped to improve students' awareness on how scientific research is performed and had a huge impact on their opinions. It also improved their communication and collaborational skills, as well as thinking outside the box and critical thinking skills. The three R's is definitely a theme to explore in every classroom.